Imagine me in the debates versus them. I would clobber them in the debates. They both look like stick figures. They both are going to say that, you know, the most inane things because that's what you have to do when you're part of that. You have to say these stupid things that you can't believe people. I mean, like, if you say that terrorists hate us because we're free, <laughs> you should not be allowed to stand on a stage and debate. I mean, they should actually, like, lock you up in, a, in, a, in, a, in some sort of room and keep you away from other people because you might be a harm to them or others. Because you need to wear a little rubber helmet. That's the kind of thing, when I hear someone say that terrorists hate us because we're free, I just have to be like, you need to wear a helmet. Because you can hurt yourself. <laughs> just in just general, I mean, you know, just in general plan, you can just hurt yourself. You need to stop. So anyway, the point being, she says, I said, she said, I, I totally love everything about you. I'm totally voting for you. you. Got my vote. I'm going to help in whatever way I can. And then, and I said, well, thank you very much. And then I said, and by the way, you remember at the beginning when you asked me if I could win? Well, I just did. <laughs> Whenever you can get the message out, a libertarian message, because right now we're screwed. I'm not going to lie to you. I mean, I don't know what we're doing. I mean, this is bad. It's as bad as it could be, and our choices between one or the other are no better on all of these options. The only choice would be to try to find somebody who's not them, and that's me. You know what I mean? And then you can vote, at least vote your conscience, and at least have a, you know, have a chance. Maybe we'll get enough people to go, this guy, you know, am I the most qualified guy in the world? I know I'm more qualified than them. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's what I know. I know that I know more about most of the things that they talk about than they do. So that's, I don't know if I am the most qualified guy in the world. I don't know if I'm the right guy for everybody. I'm a, a bar owner. I smoke cigars, I drink beers, I talk to people outside my bar and have fun. I'm a normal person. But at the same time, yeah, I'm the best guy for the job. <laughs>